this next corrective exercise is for a um, hip flexion um, deficiency or tight hamstrings. So pretty easy to find out um, where you're at here. Um, usually you'd have somebody help you and just bring you into flexion. So just bring your leg up here as far as you can, keeping the leg straight. Where can you get to? If you're already getting to about here, um, something you need to work on. Okay. So I'll start by releasing some of the tissue on the back side, so the hamstring. So take a lacrosse ball. Um, I find a softball works really good as well. So if you get in here, get it on different spots of your glutes, start up high and just move back and forth, rocking back and forth as well on that tissue. So find the bad spots, move that all the way down and just release and rock around. You can play, turn your foot out, turn your foot in, get on the tissue on the inside, on the outside. Um, another area you wanna do is on the back, on the glutes here. Um, best way to do that I find is just to lay on the ground, get yourself feet up on the box, put the ball in your glute area, find the trigger points and rock around on them. Okay. Once you've done that, now you wanna go into a stretch of the hamstring. So simple one to do. Get in here, think about pelvis rotating back, leaning forward, get into the stretch from here. All you're gonna do is hold for about 30 seconds and then push some tension down into the box. So I'm pushing down into the box for 10 seconds, do four reps of that. After you've done those four reps, now what you're gonna try and do is pull the foot off the box and pull the body towards the foot. The foot's not actually gonna come off the box, but it's gonna feel like you're pulling in this direction. Do that for about 20 seconds or so, 15, 20 seconds, then relax and see if you can sink into the stretch a little bit further. Once you've done that, we want to do a lift off. So you'll need a doorway. So get into the doorway like this. Get your leg up on the door, whatever range of motion you have. And then what you're going to want to do is be able to pull your toe down, create some tension, and lift off off for however long you can. Once that leg starts to fall back, relax, go back into it, try it again. If you find you can lift off pretty far, move in a little further. Lift off again and relax. So you'll do however many sets that you need. Remember the number's 30 we're looking for. So you do five seconds, you're doing six sets, okay? Once you're able to hold it for 10 seconds, you're doing three. Um, after that, you want to do something to get that hamstring or hip uh, moving a little bit. So what you're gonna do from here is you're just gonna do leg lifts. What I like to do is lift up, drop it out to the side, bring it around, up, drop to the side, bring it around. This whole time, my pelvis isn't moving, it's staying on the ground. 